Taiwan reported six domestic cases and four imported cases of COVID on Sunday. Of the six domestic cases, three were in Taipei, one in New Taipei, one in Taoyuan, and one in Yunling. Of the four imported cases, two were breakthrough cases, meaning they had been fully vaccinated. Let's get the details from the CECC. The first and second imported cases of the day had both received two doses of vaccine, and they only entered the country at 14 days of quarantine, so they count as breakthrough infections. One of them received the first and second doses of the AstraZeneca vaccine back in March and June. The other one received the first and second doses of the Pfizer vaccine in June and July. To date, we have a cumulative total of 19 breakthrough cases from overseas, and among these 19 cases, eight have received the Pfizer vaccine, five the AstraZeneca vaccine, and three each the Johnson & Johnson and Moderna vaccines. Meanwhile, nearly 600,000 people have registered to receive the locally developed Medigen vaccine, which will be administered starting Monday. In this initial round, the vaccine is packaged in single-dose vials, meaning each vial will only contain enough liquid solution for one patient. The Medigen vaccine is a protein subunit vaccine that can be stored at a temperature between 2 to 8 degrees and only requires a 28-day interval between doses. Common side effects include a 71% chance of soreness at the injection site and a 36% chance of muscle pain or lethargy.